Hi, Sean here, and I've uh, been testing an Android phone for the last several months and wanted to see how the Smart Lock Trusted Face feature worked. All the news about Apple's Face ID uh, being in the news caused me to finally try it. Um, so when you set this up from settings, Smart Lock, about Trusted Face, it says face matching is less secure than pattern, pin, or password. So caveat, it's less secure and a good passcode. I agree with that. I'm going to set it up. To add a trusted face, you just hold it at eye level, and it is now kind of completing a circle going around my face. Face is added and done. So now if you uh, screen lock the phone, you can see there's a little face icon down here indicating and now there's a fingerprint icon and I can swipe up if I want to do the passcode. So I'm going to turn off the screen, turn on the screen so I can see my face. Now I have an unlock icon, and in I go to the phone. So now, uh, let's see if, hi Andy, if Andy can get into my phone with a photograph that you printed up from Twitter. And what do you see, Andy? Unlock? Do I need to press something? No, you don't need to press anything. Let's see here. Just need to hold my face within view of the camera. And we're in the phone. So, if you've access to my Twitter photograph, um, you've got access to my phone with Trusted Face turned on. So less secure, I think, is an understatement, and I'll be turning this feature off because Android's smart lock is, is a world different than Apple's Face ID. Okay, thanks.